Hey, what's going on everyone? Don here and you are watching VR Gamer Dude and well today we are going to be getting our turn-based RPG on. That's right. I, I am super, super excited to check out our Caxer, our Caxer. I'm not really sure how to pronounce it, but either way you cut it, it is a turn-based RPG for virtual reality. And I can't think overrun games enough for bringing back that genre because we just don't see it very much anymore. So, alright, I'm going to jump in and play probably about the first 10-15 minutes of the story here so that we can check it out together. Let's go. Hey! Hey! What? Oh, cool! Oh yeah, I totally forgot this was like a top-down. Okay, so like when you're not battling it's a uh, god mode overview of the procedural dungeons and when you are battling it's going to switch to first person from what i saw so okay yeah i'm alive in here <laughs> cool dungeon is right I, I can only see one room but i can tell you already i'm gonna dig this please exit down that hallway okay let's go nice oh loving it already I've always loved these, like, miniature top-down things in VR. Yeah, well, I can read signs with A, yes. Or by smooshing my face really close, so... Yep, there you go. Lol. Just kidding. Alright. Oh, there's a bad guy. Toxic Imp. <laughs> Smack it to death with... Alright, I can do that. Nice. Oh, cool. All right, cool. Yeah, like I said, now we are in a first person mode for the battle. This is cool. Okay, welcome to my first battle. Battles in this game are turn based, thank God. Um, on your turn, you can attack with the enemy or you can, uh, and on the enemy's turn, they're going to attack me. Okay, uh, turn will begin when this prompt disappears. To attack, hold the grip trigger to draw a weapon so all right yeah let's go all right it's so my turn or his turn my turn ha ha smash first try da -da 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 -da. what okay all right now we're back to the dungeon so okay i'm Impressive. digging this vibe here <laughs> you're a murderer now how does that feel Hurting other AI in this world causes damage to the attacker. Oh, well, that sucks. Um, eye for an eye. Well, I don't want to run out of hit points and die. Oh, okay, so it looks like there's also an element of the world where I can do stuff. Nice. I got a comfortable hat. Can I pick up the little boxes? Oh, I can. <laughs> Those things in front of you are called stairs. Let's move on. So that's pointless. If you grab both grips. Oh, okay, cool. So we can move the world and we can rotate it. Looks like it's got some snap rotation, but that's okay because it's not during movement. So I don't mind snap rotation when it's just something like this. Right, rotate the camera with the right thumbstick. Perfect. So obviously still playing part of the tutorial here. Oh yeah, of course I got enough hit points. Look at me, I'm full. Okay. If an enemy attack hits your head, you will take damage. Move around to dodge the enemy projectiles. Okay, so we got to kind of use our play space here a little bit. Okay, very cool. 
So there is an actual physicality to it. Good riddance. Aha! Okay. Let me explain. Oh, they can use hacks, eh? Hey, I had to break the rules of this simulation a bit, like hurting others with no consequences. I can just clear all these toxins myself. Yeah, I'm definitely taking damage just by fighting here. That's an interesting thing. I've never seen any other RPG do that. Um... Let's move on. Okay, well, we don't want to get toxic balls shot at us. <laughs> you said balls. Sorry, I've been watching the new Beavis and Butthead too much. Well, that was fun, but you probably won't survive the next guy. Uh-huh. Well, something expected happens. Sweet. Okay, the music's picking up. This guy must be a boss. Final battle. Okay, final battle of training here, I think. Okay. Obviously not final battle of the game. That would be way short. Nice! Rock! Whoa, whoa, what did I do? Oh, sweet. I got the Arcaxer Caxer module. Arcaxer, Arcaxer. I still want to know how to pronounce the damn game's name. Okay. So let's see. Now I've got some magic. No, I got to aim better. There we go. Oh man, this is kind of difficult to aim at straight. There we go. There we go. Oh, headshot. Going down, son. That's what I'm talking about. And you said I couldn't win. Ha ha. What? Nope. Sorry. It never gets old. What? What? What was that? You're supposed to be dead. How did I use a hack? So I, you know, I because I'm very special. Yeah. Watch yourself. Hey, you watch yourself. I am special. My mommy told me so. <laughs> nice. Okay, so now we get to pick a little power up here. So what do we got here? Use your weapons without taking damage. Okay, that would be a good one. Um, enhance your hacks abilities or reflect enemy attacks with your sword. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know though. I don't want to take damage when I'm fighting just by using my weapons. So I think I'll do that. How's it going? Oh, sweet. We're like in the world. Okay. Uh, looks like you made it out okay. Yeah, I did. Taskmaster? What? Hmm. Yeah, I am a fresh spawn. Okay. Um, I was built. Okay. Nice to meet you. Okay, interesting. All the enemies are built from real people on the internet? Uh, introduce myself. I'm Sydney. I'm a scientist here at the Hub. Okay. Hey now. I got a lot online. What are you talking about? Like tens and tens of people love me.
Yeah, I know. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Uh, yeah. I'll, I'll follow you. Okay, don't like the vignette when I'm moving. I, I don't know why it's doing that, because this definitely, being third person, wouldn't be too motion-sicky. Uh, hopefully there's a way to turn that off. I have not looked through the options to see if the snap turning and the vignette can be turned off. All right. This area is perfect. Oh, okay. Seriously stoked, bro. Okay. Okay, cool. We're going to get a new module, which gives us a new spell here. So it looks like this is our inventory system. Um, and okay, we got Sydney's module here. We're going to use that. Add it to our loadout. There's our fireball. Okay, I see. There's our right hand. There's our left hand. So very cool there. Oh, there's those options, so I guess while I'm here, I will look to see if there is... Oh! Pass through mixed reality in dungeons, pass through mixed reality in battles. Oh, I'm going to have to turn that on here in a minute and check it out. Um, let's turn it on now. Feedback. Smooth turning. But still no way to turn off the vignette, so... Okay. I'll deal with it. Okay, yeah, I did. I figured it out. Let's do this. Okay, let's do it. Let's put me in a battle. Okay, well, I turned on the pass-through thing in the menu, but it doesn't look like it did anything, so... Maybe that's for Quest Pro. I don't know. Hopefully we'll know in here in about a week, week and a half. So, direction controller to change which hacks is equipped to that hand. You can equip it to four different hacks on each hand. Try to inflict a glitch on this target with that new hack I gave you. Okay, let's do it. Yeah. While you dance. not doing any damage. Okay. Oh, there we go, because I didn't have fireball on. Still not doing any damage. Oh, inflicted burn. There we go. This is so exciting. Isn't you it? can use my modules. I know, that's pretty cool. Dance about it for me, won't you? Okay, learned restore one, learned hack and slash, auto equipped. Very cool, so I'm powering up here. Interesting. Isn't it? Okay, well it better be cool. Fight my way up the stacks. Sweet, it's ready player one. Hey, there's my smooth turning though, so that's nice. Hey, bro. Yeah, it is a hot one. Oh, don't want to get your, your favorite spot taken. I got a pawn shop, so it looks like we got some shops to buy items in, so definitely starting to have RPG elements here. Mr. Bag. What's that name again? Name again is Mr. Bag. Um, sentient Punching Bag. Okay, don't worry. You can hit him without spending HP. Says, well, I can hit him without spending HP anyway because I'm the Hacks Master. Uh, no, not right now. I think for the sake of the video here, we're probably about to wrap it up anyway. So I think I'm going to go over here and uh, and talk to these people real quick and then talk to her and, and then we'll see what's going on. Did you know? Did you know what? world the strong trample the weak and the best way to get strong is to run what do you 
they say, you want to do a few miles? No, once again, not right now. Yeah, my loss, whatever. So, all right, let's go over here and talk to her one more time. Real quick, this is kind of our town center here in the hub. My friend Reggie runs a shop where he sells all the junk he finds. And our sheriff hangs out in that pub there if you want to do some quick jobs for credits. Okay, so side missions. All right. Anyway, let's keep going. We're almost there. Okay. Now, I will say movement speed seems a little slow here. Uh, I've been mashing buttons and I can't find anything that speeds me up. So, uh, developers, if you're listening here, maybe giving me an option of a faster moving speed or maybe a sprint button. That would be awesome. Uh, this is what I to show you. This is a huge tower called the Stack. Full of precious loot. However, it's also full of dangerous toxins, and there are a lot that attack normal entities without warning. Okay. Until now, no one's been able to climb very high except for the taskmaster. Yep, he did capture me. Okay. Yeah, well, that's good, though, because, see, I could climb the stack and not use any of my MP while I'm uh, fighting. Yeah, we can. I'm, I'm going to take him to task, the Taskmaster. That's what I'm going to do. You know what? I will help you, because I'm a good guy, and that's what I do. All right, cool. You know what? You charge me. Hey, lady, I'm helping you out here. Okay, yeah, it is procedural. That is cool. They, they do procedural dungeons in here, so that's why it constantly changes. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so there we go. So we can start climbing the stack here, but I think we're gonna go ahead and cap it here, guys. I, you guys get the gist of it. Uh, this is a, a typical little RPG here, uh, third person, first person for the Quest 2, and I can't wait to play more of this. Maybe I'll uh, play uh, more on a stream where we can actually climb the stack here. But for the purposes of keeping the video a little bit shorter, I think we'll go ahead and cap our little adventure today here. But I want to thank everybody for coming by and checking out what I do here at VR Gamer Dude. Uh, if it's your first time coming by, it means the world to me. If you would hit that like and uh, smash subscribe on your way out the door, I am really trying to get to that 10,000 mark by the end of the year. So any help would be much appreciated. And of course, if you're already a subscriber here on the channel, guys, you know I love you. I couldn't do it without you. Thank you so much for all the support you've given me over the years. And I can't wait to show more. I, we got some really cool stuff coming up on the channel. Got the Quest Pro on the way here pretty soon. Cannot wait to show you guys a little bit of Quest Pro stuff. Obviously, they say it's for business, but guess what we're going to do? We're going to play some games. So with that in mind, I'm going to let you go. This is Don signing off.